dear viewers thank you for watching my youtube channel in this video i will talk how to send an email using sendgrid in c sharp for sending an email using sendgrid you have to perform some mandatory steps whatever the languages are they are the first step you must have an account in sendgrid second step you need to create a sender in your sendgrid account and sender must be verified third step you must have an api key both sender and api key will give you permission to send an email using sendgrid let's browse for sendgrid type sendgrid This is the official website of SendGrid. Click start for free. From here, you can register your account. I already registered my account for the purpose of this demonstration. I will use this account. So, open it and I click sign in to sign in my already created account this is my username and the password my account has two factor authentication continue this is home page of my account since i do not have any sender registered in my account it guides me to create a new one before sending an email from here we can create a sender click create a single sender from here we can create a sender so this is the name of the sender i'm putting mojina hawk and uh, gmail.com is my sender physical address and i'm using same address at reply to sex section the company address is data path and the company address then to this this is not a mandatory field the mandatory field is city so i should fill it off and zip code i'm putting the jammy zip code and my country is bangladesh okay nickname is money so if i click create the sender will be created an email will be uh, sent to my account uh, with a verification link if if i click the verification link from the email my sender will be verified let's click create it says sender has been created to verify sender identity check your inbox at okay let's check my inbox here i have a new email and from here very very single center if i click this button my account will be verified okay here center is verified congratulations click here yeah the sender account has been verified and let's move back to the dashboard section this is my dashboard and i have created a sender so it does not guide me to create a new one 
So, but if you want to create a new sender, or if I want to create another sender, so I should navigate to the settings. Under the settings, we'll find the sender authentication. This is the web page of sender authentication. From here, we can see I have one sender. And if I click the verify single sender, this will navigate to the sender creation page. First, let's create an application for sending an email. Okay, open a Visual Studio. File, click new, project. Project, from the project template, I'm choosing console application. So click next. And the name of project will be send create email demo. And let's click, click create. I'm creating a static function. Let's go back to the uh, dashboard of SendGrid. Here, to integrate the SendGrid in C Sharp application, here is the integration guide. Yeah, there are two ways to integrate the application with SendGrid. One is Web API, another one is SMTP relay. I'm choosing Web API. So here it is. There are many languages the SendGrid supporting. So I'm going to choose C sharp. Click choose. And here is how to send email using C sharp. First note: make sure you have the prerequisites. The dotted version should be 4.5.2 or onwards. And second step: create an API key. From here, uh, we can create an API key. So, okay, name the API key. Let's click the create API key. So, this is the API key. Okay, let's copy it and use it in my application. Here, our API key. third option create an environment variable we do not need to create an environment variable because i'm storing the api key in my variable in my application variable and the fourth step it's recommending to install a new get package send it so let's copy the command and open the package manager console Paste and click enter. Okay, the package has been installed successfully. Now, environment is completely ready to send an email. To complete this functionality, functionality let's add the codes. From here, we can find the code okay let's copy all the codes P 
Pixlar neme space şu. Okay. Bana spaces sent Ten parts dot mail. Okay. So for my account, the sender is Momihawk sixteen. gmail.com and name of the sender is Marjana Hub okay and the uh, recipient is Yes, I see Gmail for gmail.com. The name of the recipient is okay. We are all set. Let's let's run the application. Let's see the response. Yeah, the success status could true and accept it. Let's browse my Gmail account. Okay, the email has been sent successfully. This is all about to send an email using same grid in C sharp. Thank you.